Two local based players have been included in Jamaica's women's team, while an exclusively overseas based unit will represent the men's outfit at the 3 on 3 Amory Cup basketball tournament in Miami, Florida from November 12 to 14. Spencer Darlington tells us more. Local based players Ashley Gordon and Tracy Ann Kelly, who has replaced Sasha Dixon, will be joined by Antoinette Bannister and Josiane Johnson, who plies her trade in France. The women's team will face off with Trinidad and Tobago event. I must say we have a fair chance of doing well. I mean, you know, the corona have take havoc on us. I mean, we have been playing basketball for quite a while now. And it also affects all the Caribbean countries, only the countries who are dominant, who are richer in finance, I must say, you know, are at a better advantage about than us going into this competition. Meanwhile, Tavon Prince, Jabulani Newby, Kevin Foster and Romain Thomas will represent Jamaica's men's team. Thomas and Foster were members of the senior national team which competed at the Central American and Caribbean pre-qualifiers in El Salvador in April. The Jamaican men will face Uruguay and Haiti in Group A qualifying action with the winner to join Canada and Argentina in Pool B of the main draw. National coordinator Rick Turner noted the chemistry between two of his players which he believes will help their chances. Jabs and Tavon both are uh, living in Canada, both in the Toronto area. They have played together before, so that will be a benefit for us. Given the restrictions surrounding COVID and, and the craziness with that, the opportunity to train together has been pretty much non-existent. But guys are training on their own. We're meeting via Zoom calls. Turner is eagerly anticipating how his charges will execute. I am expecting that we're going to compete and I'm really excited about the tournament to see how we play and see what we do. This is our first uh, foray into three-on-three -three basketball at the international level, and you know it'll be a good opportunity for us to uh, evaluate where we go um, and how we get better. The upcoming tournament is the first phase of qualifiers for three-on-three -three basketball for the 2024 Olympic Games in Paris. Spencer Darlington, TVJ Sports.